So, Duncan, there's been a bit of confusion in my head. There's always confusions in my head, of course, isn't there? But I keep calling it the GT240 kit, don't I? On the videos. You explain to us what this kit at, and we will talk about that naughty little video from last week where you nearly hit that car sideswipe. Anyway, we'll do that one in a little while. Tell me about this bloody beautiful little Lambretta in the making. Well, as you can see, it's a genuine Indian frame. Who gave you the frame? <laughs> you are <laughs> hey! With slight modifications, slightly cut, chopped, slight. not quite finished yet. Nice set of chrome forks that came from, I think, I think they came from uh, Beatspeed, I think. Right here. Yeah. So Beatspeed, talk about the engine, that's, right. talk about the electrics first. I want to talk Look about at this part. Okay, oh yeah, because you've got them, right. uh, roll about them. As you can see here, the bottom bearing doesn't look standard because it's modified and altered tapered roller bearing. And I got the idea from the top headset bearing, which I got from the late Ian Franklin which is Less. fantastic, best invention out. So I've matched up, put a top and bottom tapered roller bearing. The steering's phenomenal. It is. Set of drops, quick action throttle, front disc, general stuff you put on a Lambretta. Then move on to Anthony Towns, Scootronics Electronics. This isn't the latest CDI pickup, which I've got one behind me on the shelf, which I will put on later on. We've also got external pickup, I Anthony, have to say, it's Anthony. a nice little kit, eh? Oh, it's great. It's yeah, really um, tidy. Yeah. The spark is phenomenal. It's yeah. great. Anthony Tam's stator plate, which helps heaps with the spark and everything. And obviously, I've no lights on this yet, but it will be good. Getting onto the engine, we have a sill casing. <laughs> yeah, why not? Can't be a bit of Indian up your eye. Oh. Start at the back end, we've got a Mark Broadhurst 5 speed gearbox. The first one into New Zealand. Not the first one actually running New Zealand, the second. Christiane beat me with that. But hey, but it's the first one that's imported into New Zealand. Moving further through, the top end, the CASA SS225. She's Very a nice piece of kit. Standard, they run a 30 to a 34 mil carb. Maybe a bit bigger if you're lucky, but we went for the 38 mil Cayenne Air Striker. <laughs> Big as my LML yep. engine, eh? Yeah. <laughs> and then to suck the power out from Michael Paolotti in, Ge in Germany, we've got the Ludwig and Shearer, which he said he had matched for the SS kit on the dyno. So, fingers crossed, if you watch the video, hmm, it I've, goes okay, but we've got to get on the dyno yet. We oh, have, sorry. We have. And a jockey box and stop rear, disc, uh, rear pub. Drum brakes inside because of the Indian casing, which are second to none. Those brakes are phenomenal. As you can see in the video, it does lock up. Yeah, it does, eh? With a drop <laughs> handle, well, it's got a drop handle bar. And in the future, the idea with this little machine is you've already got the, the leg shields already done, and it's yeah. going to be in a nice little blue metal flake. 1980s style. Blue metal flake. Yeah. So, the only thing left to do again is oh. run that bloody video from last week. Hey, and you, don't forget. I, I will. Oh, yeah. Oh, what was the name again? Fenwick. Fenwick's our yeah, sponsors. Fenwick's. Yeah, he's. Yeah, Fenwick's. <laughs> bloody Fenwick's. So, uh, I must say, Good quickly, I've been on a lot of Lambrettas I've owned over 25 in my lifetime. My God, this has to be the bloody fastest, pokiest, talkiest scooter I've ever been on. I mean, power wheelie for me, my big fat ass, in first and second. And I think if I rang it a little bit more in second to third, it would have done the same there. And he so, wasn't sat on the back, he was sat on the I was, yeah, you, on the old videos you can see me sitting here trying to hold it on the floor. So it's a phenomenal scooter, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, get that chicken out of the way. <laughs> so anyway, let's run Duncan's video one more time. Ah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs>
Flat spot and then tyres. Come on that corner like a fucking bus over there. Shit. You gotta calm down with that man. Fucking hell. What, you still smell the rubber? That was seriously coming round that corner, mate. <laughs> Take the keys off him. Jason, get the keys off him. Don't let him ride it again.